Hello, everybody. Welcome to Open House. I am Megan Nielsen, the math teacher um, in the room. And I'm Darlene Wallace, the intervention specialist. And we will be co-teaching Geometry Block this year. Uh, we have two sections, so there's a morning one, um, second and third period, and then an afternoon one during eighth and ninth period. So a little bit about me, um, I graduated from Miami University uh, in 2012 and then um, got a teaching job here. I was lucky enough um, to start my career here and have been teaching ever since. In 2017, I went back to school and got my master's from John Carroll in mathematics. And a um, couple pictures there the, um, of my husband and me at an Indians game, not this year, but um, hopefully another time soon. And then our two dogs. Um, I love going hiking with them and just being outside. That is my happy place. A little bit about me. Um, again, I'm Mrs. Wallace. I'm the intervention specialist. Um, this is my 16th year here teaching at Brexville Broadview Heights High School. Um, I graduated from Cleveland State University with a bachelor's in psychology and master's in special education. I'm also the Special Programs and Services Department Chair um, here at the high school. Um, these are just a few pictures of my family, um, my two girls, um, and our dog. Um, my favorite time, my favorite thing to do is just spend time with them and make memories. Um, if our daughter is struggling in any way um, with this course, um, Geometry Block, please feel free to um, have them set up a time to meet with either Mrs. Nielsen or myself. Um, these are our free, free periods. Um, Mrs. Nielsen is available before or after school and fourth period and fifth period. I'm available after school or during first period and fourth period. Um, our only request is that you just let us know ahead of time um, so that we can make sure that we're available. Sometimes we have meetings that arise, um, but we just wanna make sure that we're here when, when they come to see us. So. All right, um, Google Classroom is going to be uh, very important this year, especially if your child is at home and doing their learning um, during hybrid and or when we end up going remote. Um, you'll find assignments, notes, videos, graph paper, just a lot of good resources that your child will need for the course throughout the year. And one of the really important things is going to be the weekly agenda. And I, as you see here, there's a red and a gold. So red is your A through L part of the alphabet and gold is the M to Z. They will be at slightly different spots throughout the week because of um, them being home or in school, but they will end up getting the same, same material, the same, um, all the same things, just in a slightly different timeline. So um, if I click on this one, this shows the red for the first week of school. Um, it has the date, the learning objective, classwork with any links and also homework. Um, if we have extra resources that week, there'll be links here um, in that last column. This is posted in Google Classroom. So if I go up to Google Classroom, um, you can, you will be able to see that there. Um, and every week is going to have a red and a gold um, agenda there while we're on different, different pages. And this document will be updated with the new week on top. So um, you can just bookmark this so that you always have access to it. It'll be updated weekly, or you can just keep clicking on it in Google Classroom. It's also on my website on the portal page so that parents, you can see it without having to log into your students' uh, Google Classroom. So that's gonna be really important as, as we go through this year and um, just to be able to stay up to date on assignments. It's also gonna be really important uh, for parents and students to be checking progress book for grades um, to make sure they don't have anything missing or um, anything like that. We will use some email blasts through progress book either for whole class um, notifications or you know, individual student um, emails and parents. So you wanna make sure that you have your email and progress book and that it is updated so you can be up to date on any announcements that we are making. And then the final part with Geometry Block is there is an Alex component. It is an online learning uh, platform that helps 
to really find any gaps that your student may have in their learning process it, from their algebra and also going into geometry. So it is something that your student will have weekly as an assignment. So you wanna make sure that they are working on that. It is individualized to each student. So um, it is a really important tool that we will use throughout the year. So that's about it for Geometry Block. Uh, please let either one of us know if you have any questions throughout the year. Have a good day.